I've got Shiloh out and she's come in for our two weekend house training. So I want to put a little bit on tape, show you where she started off at. She is sweet, you know, and she kind of like gives you this look like I'm not doing anything wrong. Um, which is, this is part of the issue that you really don't like this jumping, you know, as far as that goes. Can you get off? Off? Good. <laughs> Good. All right, just walking out here. She's a little dramatic on the leash, but we'll see how she does going for a walk. Come on. Good girl. Oh, yeah. Hi. Hello. Hi. Oh, goodness. Would you like a treat? Oh, that's a good yum nums, huh? Good girls. Oh, okay. So she does even when you're walking along. She just kind of jumps up and puts her feet on you. So that's kind of, it is kind of hard. Um, you know, to really teach them right from wrong with that. Good to see it. Um, you know, so that is, it, uh, that is going to be one of the things we're first going to have to address is that jumping, you know, as far as that goes. We're going to have to make her get down and stay. She does know how to sit. I think she sits for a treat. Off. Good. But she stays sitting once I give her the treat. So that's a little bit more advanced than most that I get out here for training. But overall, you know, I mean, it's just, this is a doodle train. They're all jumpers and it's all one of those things that's really hard to correct. But overall, I think you can do it. You've just got to be pretty consistent in it. And they've got to understand that that's wrong behavior. So we're going to start working that into our training routine, that that's not the right way we want her to behave. So, um, you know, no big problems. I think she's going to do just fine. We've got to get into it, but we'll get going for a week um, and get her back out at the end of week one and see how she's doing then. Hey, I've got Shiloh out and we've been here for a week, so I wanted to put a little bit on tape and show you where we're at. She's doing good. You know, I, I do think jumping is a big issue with her. Um, she just tends to kind of forget, but I think that the more you correct the behavior, the better it gets. Um, you know, taking some long walks helps. Um, can't say it's going to overcome everything, you know, and especially when company arrives, things like that. If I'm not watching her, obviously I'm getting some of those jumps, but when I've got my eye on her and she's, you know, in work mode, she's doing really good with it. Um, she knew quite a bit. So that was helpful because that just made it was easier to go along with what I was expecting of her, um, you know, as far as that goes. So, um, I think that she's doing well. She's come a long ways in the first week, but we just need to, we need to keep going so we can get even better. All right, Miss Shadow, want to go? No. Let's go. Sit. Come up and sit. No. S stay. No. Stay. Not holding till the release command a little bit. No, off. <laughs> okay. Sit. Good. Let's go. She's got to learn to just kind of settle down and wait into it. That's part of the issue that I think that she has. She gets a little bit hyper and then she kind of forgets that she actually does know what she's supposed to do. Shiloh, sit. Good, sit. Let's go. Uh. Sit. Stay. No. Sit. Stay. She's going to tell me she was done with the stay and she's not. Okay. Let's go. Shiloh, sit. Good girl. No, sit. Let's go.
We're going to do one more stay. Stay. So we almost had the last one right. Okay, that was correct. That was the way we know we need it. Yes, off, off. Oh, you're so dramatic. Good. All right, come here. Sit. She likes to play the get it come game. She's doing pretty good. The first time I did this though, holy cow, come in and all over me. So it's a good way to remind you that when you're, when she's coming in, she has to sit. She can't be jumping all over people. Hey, I got it up here. Get it. Shiloh, come sit. Good. And you have to be quick with the sit command. Get it. Shiloh, come sit. Good. And notice I'm not letting her get in too close. Get it. Shiloh, come sit. Good. Get it. Come. Hurry. Come. Sit. You missed that one. What happened? What happened? Get it. There it is. Good girl. Come. Good. And I've been reaching down. No. So we're not even allowed to shake. If she's been taught to shake, we need to stop that until she stops the jumping. So I think everything else has fallen into line. She's doing really good, you know, she's come a long ways in the first week and I think she's trying really hard to figure it all out. Um, you know, she knew sit. She just likes to be, you no, know, an active girl. No, off. Don't put your foot over the leash. Sit. But I think the more she gets the no and the off, the better it'll get. It's gonna take a little bit of practice on your part, but she's got another week to go and that hopefully is gonna get even better. So we're gonna put her up and we'll get her back out at the end of week two before she heads home and see how she's doing then.